Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. Today I am going to show you how to model a basketball in 3ds Max. Today I am just doing the modeling of the ball and later I will be doing the texturing. Ok let's start. Come to perspective view with Alt W. Create a sphere for the ball. And now to segments to 16 and radius to 50. Now let's make the ball uh, a editable poly. Right click and editable poly. And then choose edge. Now come to top view and uh, in edge section choose for edit edit geometry. In edit geometry you can uh, select cut. Now cut these exact vertices. The first one here, the second down. And the third over here. And below that the last one, the fourth. Okay, let's delete the other edges around them. So select these edges. Uh, select all the edges around them except the vertical edge in between uh, all these lines. Select all of them and uh, now give control backspace. Give control backspace to delete them. Okay, now uh, come to perspective view, and you can see that down there it's not uh, it's not changed. So let's change them by uh, going to polygon and deleting them. The middle off and uh, in a modify panel give sim symmetry and give Z axis. Now come to top view and uh, uh, choose vertices. And now choose these two vertices and scale them down. Now again choose the middle vertices and scale them down again. Uh, okay. And now choose uh, this exact uh, edge and give them loop. Loop selected uh, selects all the edges connected to a single edge. And now give chamfer. Uh, chamfer amount to uh, I think two. Two, okay and segments to one now uh, chamfer them again uh, yeah chamfer them again and this time give it 0 0.2 okay now select these edges one uh, second No, uh, again, uh, one, this one in the middle and the th third one. You can now uh, select loop. All the edges are selected, connected to them and give them chamfer. Chamfer them among two the first time and again chamfer them, this time 0 0.2. Chamfer and 0 0.2. Segments one, okay. Uh, now uh, okay as you can see it's the same down there now because I have given it symmetry and uh, there's the little shape of the basketball but uh, we'll have to bevel them to give a exact proper shape now come to modify panel and give turbo smooth now let's go to edge uh, but before I'll make it an uh, editable poly right click and editable poly Uh, and now come to top view uh, and then uh, select edge and now select these exact edges right in the middle of the set so uh, set of uh, these e uh, these edges all the middle edges now and them and then loop all the select all the connected edges are selected now and now give control plus the polygon button yeah okay now the polygons are selected instead of the edges and now uh, uh, now give them grow in the selection uh, bar give them grow now all the edges uh, all the polygons are selected now uh, for giving the basketball shape and now uh, all, I, all I have to do is give them bevel give bevel and it's all messed up now so I'll be giving it local normal just local normal and give the height of uh, I think around uh, 
माइनस जीरो पॉइंट टू फाइव ओके माइनस जीरो पॉइंट टू फाइव जीरो पॉइंट टू फाइव नाउ अगेन आउटलाइन अमाउंट ऑफ पॉइंट फाइव माइनस पॉइंट फाइव ओके एंड या इट इट विल बी गुड आई थिंक and now uh, that's it as you can see now the uh, shape of the ball is final uh, finally here and uh, in this video i'm just doing the modeling and the next video you'll be seeing the texturing of this ball uh, thank you and subscribe